I'm so confused this morning. I just woke up. Um, I'm having a hard time deciding what to wear. I've not had a bath, but I'm just deciding. I'm just trying to decide in my head what to wear today. So for those that do not know, um, for those that are not following me on Instagram, I have an event today. Well, I run a food processing and packaging company right here in Abuja, Nigeria. So I was invited for an event at the Presidential Villa Asu Rock, Abuja, and. I'm having a hard time deciding what to wear for real. I don't know if I should wear what I'm going to wear on a normal day, like wear what myself, what I would be very comfortable in, or if I should wear what, like dress like the people in power, because well, here in Nigeria, when you're going to, when you're going to a place where you're going to have lots of dignitaries and people in power, it's just best you dress like them just to blend in. So I'm having a hard time. I don't know if I should wear a jalabia. Or if I should wear a corporate dress or I don't know. Let me just go have a bath first. When I get out, we are gonna decide. So I just got up the shower and like I said, right? My problem with what to wear is I don't want to go and compromise. I don't want to go and wear what I'm not comfortable in and then um, I will not get there and see everybody well dressed hmm. I'm going to feel out of place even though that's not really going to be the case if you ask me I think you know people are going to wear native you know some people are going to wear um yeah native and that kind of you know kind of outfit I'm planning to wear I'm tired to go for the channel yeah. I'm just gonna get ready now. I'm gonna see you guys after my meet. Anastasia Beverly Hills um, I was called by the way just now to say that I should start coming you know I was called by a friend of mine we're going together I should, I should start coming that we have to meet at the Eagle Square by 8 and this is <laughs> past 8 already the event is for 10 o'clock so I'm wondering where that information came from though so I'm going to do this real quick and I'm going to see you as my makeup is over I'm using my time wise foundation. I have to go for a darker shade because I'm a bit dark or I am darker now. So I just hope um, my powder and foundation is going to blend in. Dark and I'm breaking out. I cannot understand why. But man. So well, I think that my face is white because I think the foundation is still too bright. I don't know what to do. I'm in a haste. I have to manage like that. Yeah, let's keep doing this. So I'm going to be adding a darker color around the area that I'm supposed to be contouring just to, you know, add some warmth to my face. You know, because I feel it's too white. So let me just warm it up. So finally, um, I'm out of the house. I'm not sure if I should, you know, tie my hair or leave my hair. I'm not sure, but I'm just wearing something really simple. This is the invite. 
bro, I don't have so much time. I gotta go. Catch ya soon, guys. So I'm leaving, leaving, leaving. I hope I meet up. I'm actually like an hour early. Guys, I'm gonna see you there. So, doing this vlog today has not been easy. Even knowing fully well that I'm actually actually late or running late I just called though my friend is already in the villa she said I should go to Eagle Square and then there are buses that are going to take us into the villa from Eagle Square so I'm doing just that it's not easy vlogging and um, doing stuff but I tried I must give it to myself man I must give it to me this is my house and earrings don't try me I've had these for like forever but I've never won it you know I just hope you know that what I'm wearing is appropriate it's not being like legal can you see this traffic I'm not sure I'm filming this well like this traffic it's so long so at least I can see the junction now I've been in this traffic for quite some time I just hope I don't go late because of this traffic I just hope I'm still gonna meet them there um, let's see how it goes. So I'm right here. I'm at the Eagle Square, and they said like five buses already left. So there's actually no bus right now. <sighs> the sun, man. There's actually no bus, but I'm just trying to rush to go stay with some people that are as late as I am right now. This event is for ten, and this is just nine. This is past nine, and. Jesus, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the bus just got here. The bus just got here. I'm so excited. Ooh, yeah. <sighs> thank God. See you guys later. So we are. Like we're going home. Like so we're, we're going home. It's over. Sure. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm back from the event. It was so beautiful. I learned a lot. So I saw the Oni of Ife, and I really liked him. He was quite young. Like most of the time when I see traditional rulers, they're always very old. He was really young, and he had this hype man. 
that was just singing his praises. Like before he came up stage, you know, the hype man was singing his praises, saying lots of things in Yoruba. Uh, you know, the one servant stood behind him with um, a, a long staff. And the material that they used to make the staff was the same material that the traditional ruler had on his head. It was so beautiful. And then I realized that if he dies eventually, then they're going to bury one of those servants with him. Amazing. Like they still do that right now. I was shook. I was so shocked. And then I met um I, I met this man, General Buba. Marwa or something, I'm not too sure about his name. Um, he said he was a former governor of Lagos State and he was the one that brought Keke Napep to Nigeria. That is why a lot of people call it Keke Marwa because his name is Buba Marwa, General Buba Marwa. Yeah, so it was such a beautiful event. I'm stepping out briefly now with my brother and our friend were going to pick up a package that I have to collect at God is Good. Uh, you guys to come with me if you want. This is like a bush girl, like a I like you. Local house that woman. <laughs> hey God. Hey. Hey, no matter how I try to dance, with this my outfit. Doesn't you know why? It's fine. Nah. I saw what you say, like, you know, it's called the Bari event. It now looks like one. Well, it's called the Bari event, she's wearing it. Yes, no. But it's not like every day. Is this what you have to do? I'm going to add this to my vlog, though. So you guys are going to appear on my YouTube channel. No, I can't. Hey! Yes. No, I can't. I can't do <laughs> You're actually appearing already. You man. are showing. You guys should. Speak to my lawyer, you know, get you a, a good deal. They are showing no better than no. That nah, puts you. Hey, 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 hey. This, the music for the song that Travis performed. Jesus, I'm so hyped. Oh, I had man, such a great time today. GIG Logistics. <laughs> yeah, we're here. I'm still dressed like an archer. Yeah. So God is good. Man, the weather is hot, man. How do we even leave? <sighs> so hot, even Dubai don't reach this one. Yeah! Package got in. I'm so excited. <laughs> um, I'm finally home now. <sighs> I just had a bath and applied my shea butter. <laughs> I'm a shea butter queen. I always love to apply shea butter. And guys, I'm so sorry. I know you guys expected so much, but I'm going to explain. I was going to, you know, show you guys everything. As you can see in this vlog video, I tried to film from when I woke up in the morning up till now that I'm about to go to bed for you guys to see everything but I was sincerely I was unable to because something happened to my phone you know I was filming with my phone <laughs> and my phone fell down it's a long story I went somewhere to go get my car back to the villa because initially they didn't allow us drive in i had to go drop my car at um the eagle square and all all that but somehow somehow my phone fell down and my camera cracked i could still film but my camera is now very blurry so you know it got to a point where i started filming with just the front camera because that's all i could do at the time you know i'm gonna do better though you know this is my first time filming an actual vlog from the time where I woke up up till now like it's my first time I'm gonna do better I'm gonna do better I'm gonna do better I'm so sorry I hope you enjoyed this if you did kindly give the thumbs up 
hit the notification bell so you can get notified each time I have a new video up and subscribe to my channel if you like my content I'm so grateful thank you for staying with me all through the day well I enjoyed doing this I thought it was going to be stressful it was stressful you know filming all through but well I enjoyed it Maybe because it's my first time I enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed it too did you enjoy it to be sincere if you did I'm so glad I'm so so glad thank you guys you know I wanted to show you guys around the villa you know for those that have not been there I wanted to show you guys what it looks like it's nothing fantastic though but I wanted to still show you guys somehow I couldn't I'm sorry I am sorry I apologize I'm gonna see you guys in my next video bye I'm so exhausted I have to go sleep right now